This is the port of the salt shaker North Star. There are two monitors. As you can see, we're going to do this one at a time. I'm going to crank this one up, run through all the buttons, and uh, show you that it works just fine. And then we'll do the other one and crank it up and run through all those buttons. charts hit it one more time gonna hit Florida and we can zoom in There's a point where you zoom in too much and it won't let you go any further. So that's as tight as we can get it. This is the position. Shows us our exact coordinates and time. This is the steer. So and then the radar. We gotta hit the end button, enter button. You can barely see the radar, but it is turning. Right now we're at uh, quarter nautical miles. And we can go half mile, one mile, two miles, 12 nautical miles, 16, 24, 36 is our maximum range. Back the charts. Let's turn on the starboard. While that's starting up, let me go back over here to the sounder. I think I forgot the sounder. Here's the sounder. But it's not currently in the water. So uh, it's going to act a little funny, but it does work. Go back to charts. This is going to start up. You can see everything's okay. charts agreeing to all these warnings charts again this is the master on the port side and this is the slave we'll hit charts one more time we'll select Florida we can zoom in, just like we did over there. Once again, to go so far. Here's the position of where we are. The steer charts, the radar, 
we don't have to hit the radar since we've already entered into the radar screen you can see we're still at the 36 nautical miles 24 16 12 8 6 4 3 2 1.5 1 3 quarters half a mile and a quarter of a mile you can see we're picking up some clouds now sounder again we're not in the water there's a sounder and we'll go back to positions so we have where we are and where we are as far as coordinates go we can flip put sounder over here we put radar over here We can put position over here, radar, we can put our charts over here, whatever we want to do.